Hello everybody, welcome uh, in the second video of discovering the Dolphin Cam 2. Uh, in the first video we've set up uh, the Dolphin Cam and in this video we're gonna see uh, a little bit about the um, software itself, the layout of the software and how the Dolphin Cam actually works. Currently the transducer um, is on green light, that means that it's paused, it's not recording or it's not producing images right now. Um, there's a button on here, uh, if we can click it, you can see that the light starts blue. It starts recording and you can see on the screen itself that it starts, um, that, it pr that it's producing images right now. Uh, when you want to scan, just add some coupling agent, place your transducer on it, make sure that there's enough coupling agent between the transducer and your material, and then you can start scanning. We can see above here that we have four tabs in total, uh, starting with the Dolphin Cam 2 tab. Um, this actually explains um, what, we what we have discussed in the first video on how to start up everything, how to connect everything, and um, how to start scanning. Then secondly, we have a files tab. Here you can open uh, and save some uh, settings. For example, you can save scans um, and you can load scans as well uh, then the third tab is the inspection tab um, this is actually for the live inspection so if we turn on the uh, turn on the transducer then you can see that currently we can i'm moving the transducer over the material and you can see the image moves uh, then we have some settings for the transducer here as well calibration signal and image uh, but we'll cover that in a later video and then finally we have the help function which has uh, the specs of the um, uh, of the software so firmware versions um, but also some serial numbers as well not really important for now and then we have the battery status of the black box uh, so at the back and we have the uh, if everything is connected 